In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a film intro video or art intro video in Adobe After Effects. So, before starting this tutorial, let's have a look what we are going to create in this video. So this is the animation we need to make in this video. So you can see that I am in After Effects that I have already created this animation and now I am going to show you how to make this. So I am going to close this and this is the stock photos I am going to use in this video. Let's drag them to After Effects and then create a new folder with them. Then create a new composition. I am going to make it into 2 pixel by 1080 pixel then hit ok now let's create a new solid and rename it element of course you need element to plug in to make this so now hit ok now let's create a new text and type now just close this text and select this element and then go to effect and preset and search for uh, element 3d and apply it now go to custom layer and then go to custom text and mask from here select this text and close it now click on the send setup from here turn off the grid and then go to create and create a new sphere now select this default and then click on this after that go to your folder where you download this photos and select this earth photos and drag them to after effect and drop into the diffuse hit ok so this is our earth is ready now click on this extrude so here is our text let's bring it to the font now go to presets and then go to bevels and i'm going to apply this I think this is good looking good to me from here you can change the color something like this kind of color okay just hit okay you can select the sphere and make the art size something like this Okay, and from the single light change it to aqua and then go to environment and select b1 environment and select the color to garage now hit ok and from here now let's create a new camera i am going with a 24mm camera then hit ok now select this and let's zoom it little bit like this and i can actually change the text size to something like 60 let's increase the art size select this go to scene setup and select the spare model and change it to 165 and let's drag this text to outside of this group and change it to group 2 now hit ok now it's looking good to me now go to around 10 second select the element go to group 1 then go to particle replicator and then click on rotation press alt and click on the y rotation and then type this expression time star minus 5 so it will rotate our art like this now close this and then go to group 2 go to particle looks and then go to deform 
then click on this paint and enable it now change it to 90 degree and create a keyframe on bent angle and again go to particle replicator then go to rotation also create a keyframe to this rotation then back to the first frame something like this and then again go to deform and let's bend it Change it to 145 and let's change the rotation something like this now select the camera then click here and open transform and I will everything here and then select all of these keyframes and drag them to around 10 second and then create this camera and move this art to something like this point and let's zoom it here and now let's rotate it Now select this, press U and change this rotation below bend angle to something like this Now select all of these keyframes and drag them to the first frame and also drag them to at the first frame now select this text let's make it 160 let's change the art size select sphere and make it 180 now hit ok now let's create a new light so I'm going to create a new solid, rename it flare. Now hit OK. Now you can go to effect and preset and search for lens flare. Apply it. Now change its mode to add and change this layer type to 105 prime. Then drag it to outside of this. Something like this point now create a keyframe here press u and drag this keyframe to the beginning of this layer and then drag this to something like this point now fit it to the screen select this layer go to effect and press it and search for tint and change this color to something like this blue now hit ok after that from here go to project and drag this blue hash to the timeline and change its color to white now let's add this star to the background and let's increase its size something like this and drag this to this side now press P create a keyframe drag this to at the beginning of this frame and then drag this to something like this point or maybe this let's fit it to the screen now close this now let's create a glow effect on the earth select this element press ctrl d and select this go to effect in presets and turn off group 2 then select and rename it to glow 
and select this go to effect and preset and search for glow effect and from here change this glow color to something like blue and from here change it 90 and change glow radius to 123 and change this glow based on to alpha channel and change glow intensity to 0.9 sorry 0 0.9 Let's select this flare and change its color to something like darker blue. Hit OK. So now let's see the preview. So this is the animation. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, then make sure to like this video and. If you still not subscribe or new to channel then make sure to subscribe this channel and don't forget to share this video with your friends and please comment how was this tutorial and what you want in my next tutorial so thank you so much again for watching goodbye